Hello, and uh, welcome to the Fits on the Go uh, blog. We have uh, Dr. Eugene Braunwald, who does not need any introduction with us here today. We just finished a brilliant talk on heart failure. Um, so Dr. Braunwald, what was your most uh, favorite session during the ACC meeting, or what have you enjoyed the most? Well, I, uh, I enjoyed the most the opening uh, clinical trials. Um, because they were a real contrast. Um, Dr. Deepak Bhatt showing that uh, a randomized trial in renal denervation really didn't show very much. And I guess the reason that's so important is that, um, um, is that uh, all the other observations have been made uh, without having a control group. And so it shows that we have to, we need rigorous controls, and uh, you know this method has been used uh, uh, in thousands of patients outside the United States, um, and uh, uh, with marked reduction in blood pressure. But he showed that the placebo group uh, also had a reduction in blood pressure, so that was very important. And then Dr. David Adams uh, showed the core valve results and compared them in in. Uh, in sick aortic stenosis patients, not the sickest ones, but in very sick ones, uh, that uh, it was actually superior to, uh, to cardiac surgery. And, and, and that's a breakthrough, because up to now, showing um, um, uh, non-inferior results, showing e equality, uh, everybody likes uh, the TAVR, because it is not as invasive, obviously, and it's much easier on the patient. But uh, every, you know, the thinking has been that it is no better. This is the first trial that has shown actual improvement in survival. Wonderful. Um, those were extremely interesting uh, topics that we really enjoyed. So um, just what, what would be your um, input or suggestions to fellows in training um, as they finish training and get out into the real world? What would be your suggestion? Well, I think the suggestion is, is when you go into the real world, uh, don't lose your academic roots because you spent uh, all of your training in college, medical school, residency um, in uh, training institutions and uh, maintain a close link to that. Uh, if you're in practice, uh, obviously if you stay in one of these institutions, that's fine. But if you don't, that doesn't mean you shouldn't uh, have some connection because that's where you get most stimulation and that's where seeing young people asking difficult questions is most stimulating. Well, thank you very much, sir. Okay.